a few years, the residents of Wheeling and beyond will be able to enjoy good company while learning about the area's rich history. News 9's Olivia Zinn has the latest details on one downtown development. After months of anticipation, demolition is officially underway for the Wheeling Gateway project, as well as new designs have been unveiled. The former Wheeling Inn will be transformed into the new Wheeling Visitors and Heritage Center, totaling to a projected $19 million. The site will feature a rooftop restaurant, an elevator extending to the walking trail, plenty of outdoor space and more. Nearly all of the features were determined by the community's feedback in February. You'll see a lot of really great material choices in the order of priority in the way that the community voted on it, which would have a combination of glass, steel, brick, uh, paying homage to all the industry of the past for, for the city of Wheeling and, and you know what a, what a lot of manufacturing had once done. For the first time in 150 years, visitors and locals will be able to have an unobstructed view of the Wheeling Suspension Bridge. Wheeling, Ohio County CVB officials calling it a hub off I-70 and the historic structure. We're hoping that visitors will come off the highway, uh, come to the gateway of the city of Wheeling and come to the visitor center, find out what's going on in Wheeling, where they can go, where Ogilvy Resort is, where the casino is, uh, where the Independence Hall is. But more importantly, Visit Wheeling Director Frank O'Brien says is the shared experience that can be built around the new building. People are going to come here and just sit look at the bridge. Uh, they're going to walk down to the Heritage Trail. There'll be an elevator taking people down to the trail. This is a pretty important day in, in Wheeling's history. Demolition is on track to be completed by the end of the year. Officials say construction should be completed within the next couple years and be sure to stick with us here at News 9 as we continue to follow its developments. Reporting for News 9, I'm Olivia Zinn. Hi, I'm Jessica Riley. Thanks for watching. Here's another video for you to view and also take a moment to subscribe to our channel.